Hey guys, I'm back again with another video. So this time we can't cancel the video. Because the internet is working fine now. You already know the drill. First up is my region, which is North America. Oh, God. I forgot to switch it to expert. I'm stupid. There we go. So the number one level for North America is the Mysterious Purple Curtain. Which is made by a name I'm, I won't even try to pronounce. And we gotta close our eyes so that we can choose our character. You know what, actually to make it more fair, we're gonna press the character. Okay, we're playing as Luigi. Too many comments. Oh, the grape soda is rising. Huh? Where the heck am I? What? Okay, what just happened? Oh, I get it. So whenever the grape soda rises, something happens off screen. We gotta get the fans. Always get the fan. Did you guys just see that? Mario dipped his feet in the grape soda. Because of the brightness of the recording, it may not look purple, but it actually is purple. <sighs> I forgot to set it back to the beginning. It's loading, because, you know, internet problems. Well, looks like you guys will have to sit through a whole tree topper. Because most of the times you guys don't really get to hear the tree topper for that long. Usually you guys hear it for like 30 seconds or something. We did it. The moon, see look, the moon is even there. And the moon decided to take a, the moon decided to have a taste of the grape soda. The juice, the apple juice? No, let's collect the moon just for the fans. I'm so stupid for that. Well, looks like we're gonna, looks like we're gonna have to sit through that whole thing all over again so that time we didn't die nice pixel art yeah look at that okay I waited I waited too long my record was 4 minutes and 52 seconds that probably took up half the video Next up is Europe, which I think makes the best levels in this game. The number one level for Europe is Reaction Test Part 1. 
made by Dari 2033. Oh, it's tagged for multiplayer versus. That's going to end well. Up, oh, Wi Fi problems. Oh, it decided to load. I thought it was going to say something like, communication error. 53 seconds. Oh, yeah. The creator was in line. We do have to think fast. Okay, so I can think fast in Mario Maker, but I can't think fast in real life. I'm a noob at thinking faster than real life. Get out there, That's not that that last one wasn't really thinking fast. Cause you can kind of cheese it by just jumping on the cannonball. Checkpoint. <laughs> okay, cannonball hitboxes are weird. Some Sometimes they are smaller than they look. So that, so that cannonball should not have hit me. Skull coaster momentum. You know what? This should become a joke on the channel. Did you guys know that that clown cars and spikes do not mix? Okay, that was my fault. But we still made it anyway. Nice troll. Okay, he got me. He got me. There's even a GG at the end. That's how you know this is a good level. That's a quadruple like just because of the troll alone. He got me. And plus he put spikes over the semi-solids. So, so we all know when we hit spikes, you die or take damage. But if you place a semi-solid over spikes, for some reason, they don't hit you. Next up is Asia, which I think makes the worst levels in the game. Because we all know the Japanese levels are wild cards. You could just have a 50-50 chance. You either get a good level... Or a bad level. Sometimes in between. Lift platforming 41. Y the apple juice? This would be a great level to get an endless expert. But for some reason... The algorithm in the game is so messed up. Like, seriously, 80% of the time, you pretty much get the bad levels. Wait, how long is this? 56 seconds and proper checkpoint placement. You know, it's so sad that you don't get Japanese levels like this in Endless Expert. It's just so sad. So I believe we 
let that platform fall? Skull Coaster Momentum. God dang it, man. I didn't even see that key coin. And yes, they are called key coins. My laptop is about to shut off. Don't shut off, laptop. We need you for the tree toppers. There's a THX. Gamer Mally coming in clutch. Also, do you guys like the new channel name? And do you guys also like the new profile picture? Sure. It was good. Endless Expert would be a lot more enjoyable. If they would just give us levels like these. Like the good levels. But instead, we get the trash levels where you have to, like, find a hidden block that has a key in it. Or, like, a 3D World Little Timmy level where it's just five Boom Booms and then one Meowser and they have to defeat all of them. Next up is the other, aka Australia. It still triggers me why they call it that. And I've also found out that they also have Hong Kong, which is technically not a country. And they also have New Zealand. You know, we're just going to scroll down until we find a New Zealand flag. Is that? Yep, that's New Zealand right there. So the Australia flag and the New Zealand flag look similar. But here's a trick that I learned. This is the Australian flag. That has five stars, and they're white. The New Zealand flag has red stars, and they have four star, And they have four stars. Always remember that. But the number... Okay, we're gonna play... We're gonna play the same level that we played a few weeks ago, I think? Yeah, we played this a few weeks ago. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go find. Yep, I just died. So anyway, we're gonna find a popular level Sunday video on the channel real quick. Guys, we found the video. It's on Gamer Mally's popular level Sunday episode three. Funny Timmin. It's literally the same maker and the same level. Yeah, little Timmy levels can actually be. It's literally the same level. I can't believe it. We're literally playing the same level that we played two weeks ago. I'm blaming hitboxes. Because I clearly pressed jump. No, we're going to blame my B button and hitboxes. The troll. That troll. Huh? Did you guys see that? Okay, I clearly touched the axe. But Lud but Ludwig over here. Yeah, with the fat tooth. Ludwig there? He freaking Bro, he just freaking yeeted towards me. Yeah, I remember this speedrun level being kind of janky with his hitboxes. Cause sometimes the enemies spawn way too early. I got blocked by Tequavion. This will also be a great level to get on Endless Expert. But guess what? 
the algorithm is messed up. That's one of the things I want to be fixed in Mario Maker 3. Yes, I said Mario Maker 3. Because apparently, two years ago, Nintendo said that they'll no longer have support for this game. So that means no more updates, no more nothing. I can't believe we literally played the same level from two weeks ago. Oh, I'm looking at the description for episode 3, and it says this was supposed to come out yesterday, but someone in all caps had to watch the Super Bowl on the thing I record with. We can all guess who that is. Wait a minute. Is that a New Zealand flag? That is New Zealand. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.